Libra. This is your July monthly reading. I said it wrong in the Gemini reading. So Libra, if this video resonates with you, there will be an extended at the end. I also recommend you checking out your moon, rising, or Venus signs to get the whole picture of what's going on. So I'm going to pull some oracle cards and then I'm going to jump right into the reading. Libra. In the process of me shuffling before the camera started, this popped out. And this is co-create with spirit. Crow spirit. Okay. Stag spirit, take the lead. Take the lead. Butterfly spirit, transformation is beautiful. Okay, so Gemini had this in the unseen, like what you're not seeing portion. So on the bottom, scarab beetle spirit, magic works through you. You're not seeing the magic inside of you. <sighs> Taking action into a new direction. There's a major change that's coming. And change can be uncomfortable. I'm feeling a lot of uncomfortableness with this. Like, I feel like, yeah, we'll see what the tarot cards have to say. <clears throat> it's about you stepping into your power. You being um, strong in who you are. The situation is moving away moving away from things that are no longer serving you and breaking free from the things that you have, that have attachments to you. Whoop. That's the situation. The opportunity is the hanged man is to see things from a new perspective and to take your time. Nine of cups in the past, your happiness. There was some happiness in the past. The universe wants you to know tower. Things are going to very much get blown up. The hermit, how you got here was definitely trying to find your way trying to find your way through the dark the near future is the world princess of cups is how you're seen page of cups is you're seen as somebody who has a lot of love to give a lot of potential knight of swords maybe some conflict in the near future that's coming up so it's like you have a little conflict some things that are some words maybe harsh words that are going to be said, and then you get your happiness. Hopes and fears. Your hope is to be stable and firm, but you're afraid is to be alone. And Prince of Swords, so Page of Swords, in the outcome. What are you not seeing? about clear coming out the outcome is clarity and truth so eight of wands seven of wands two of pentacles four of cups empress ace of cups that will be read in the extended so queen of wands stepping into your power but definitely ending it's almost like cutting ties with some sort of psychological contract that I'm seeing. <laughs> like you're doing it, but I almost feel like you don't even know that you're doing it. Eight of cups, so it's moving on. It's definitely breaking free and building a whole new foundation in yourself and being inspired by yourself being passionate. I'm feeling a little bit of drama though, but take the lead very much so. Taking control of whatever it is that was not serving you. Seeing things in a new perspective, like what is it that, like the opportunity is definitely to see things that are changing. It's like you have anxiety over some stuff or maybe you have anxiety over taking lead or maybe you have anxiety over this transformation, but it is most definitely something that is going to serve you and benefit you. Six of Pentacles and Nine of Cups. Your happiness was very balanced. It seemed very balanced and um, highly connected. 
it was equal give and take in relationships. And I, I don't know, I, I think you thought it was give and, equal give and take, but something's gonna be blown up here. Let's talk about this tower. The universe wants you to know. Um, that's frustrating, but it is what it is. The tower was clarified by the Wheel of Fortune and the Magician. So what this tells me is that you really don't have a choice. Like things are gonna get blow up because there needs to be a new foundation. There needs to be a new structure. It's like things are gonna get flipped upside down. And it's gonna be more, um, what's the word I'm looking for? There will be more resources after the fact. More resources available after the fact. Death. Very much. Okay, so you really need to go check out the Gemini reading because they got the death card and they got um, the butterfly spirit as well. So you had a transformation in your past, but you're also having one in your future. It was like you were alone for a long time. And so that was being transformed, and now it's like you're moving into another transformation. In the near, near future, temperance. So the world is clarified by temperance and six of swords. It's all about balancing, bringing in things that are um, for your best and highest good, and releasing things that are not good for you anymore. Getting rid of negative, negative aspects. Being, you are being seen as... That's really cool. So you're definitely all about having love and giving love and receiving love, but you are very much strong and firm. So you are being seen as the king of swords and the queen of swords. It's almost like you're being seen as somebody who is like so cold, as loving and as caring as you are, and apologetic and hopeful as you are, you're being seen as somebody who is very cold. And very, like, so truthful it doesn't come off as truth. And the butterfly again. I'm just going to pull one more card for this. High Priestess. You're being seen as somebody who is supposed to be cold when it comes to the truth. You're supposed to, so Libras have a tendency to be very indecisive, but I feel like you must have a lot of other air sign in your um, chart because this is very much Aquarian energy. Very honest and outspoken about and communicative. communicative. It's like you're being honest, but it's like you only give a little bit of information, so you're kind of being seen as somebody who is, like, not telling the whole truth. Because you're so straight to the point and so firm and so... There's no explanation at all. It's literally like, yes, no, um, over there. You know, it, there's no, like, fluff or actual communication when it comes to stuff. It's so cold that it almost feels like you're hiding something. That's what I'm looking for. Okay. There's a situation that is going to very much be about a conflict. It's really going to break your heart. Um, but it is definitely something that is going to give you balance. you got the Three of Swords and the Lovers. It is going to really open you up to more potential. It's going to definitely be a decision that you have to make and to move on to this. There we go. Sorry. Hopes and fears. You don't really want to stop resisting whatever is coming. Like, that's why you're going to get the tower moment. Things are definitely going to blow up. Okay, you really, 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 really need to check out that Gemini reading because in the outcome, their outcome was the Five of Wands and the Seven of Swords right after that. And you got... You got actually one of the cards that they were missing. They were missing the Page of Swords, and you got that as the outcome. So it's almost like you were working, and you got the Gemini card right here, so I feel like there's a potential Gemini in your life that you might be working with that you're going to be able to be clear about how they're actually going to be able to help themselves. Or 
or vice versa. Remember, you have to flip the script if you're a cross watcher or, you know, if these are, these are general readings. So because it's not actually directed for you and it's like for everybody and for the collective, you have to pick and sometimes reverse the roles in those situations. So I feel like you have a lot of clarity to help this Gemini, like your cold hearted truth, like the way that you talk, the way that you are, like the Gemini is supposed to reflect something of that sort to be able for them to have the love that they are trying to reach to, that calmness, the love but not emotional happy but not emotional interesting so Libra this is your reading for you um, in the extended I'm gonna go over timeline blockages advice and things that you're not seeing don't forget to hit the like subscribe and share button and a couple of videos are gonna pop up here and if the title resonates with you I highly recommend that you check them out so thank you so much and I will see you in the extended